What are we going to do today, Ralph? I was thinking that we could watch some movies I haven't seen in a long time and review them. Never know, people might watch this. So we're going to watch the movie Jack, starring Rob Williams. Rob Williams was in films such as Aladdin, as the Genie, Mrs. Doubtfire, Dead Poet Society, and then he was in a couple other movies that we don't want to really talk about, especially the one where he's a dad that can't get over his son's masturbation fetish that ends up killing him. Yeah, it was fucking weird. So without further ado, here's Jack! So we start off the movie with Jack's mom and dad, and of course, Jack's mom's pregnant. <laughs> God, so bloated. She's binging. Binging, she's fat. What? But there's a difference between being pregnant and fat. I can tell the difference, and I've never been pregnant. But I've seen pregnant people, unless you're really super fat, and then it like covers up your pregnancy, so no one knows if you're fat or you're pregnant. It doesn't matter, you got a kid, or maybe you like chocolate cake, it doesn't give a fuck. So then it cuts over where the doctors tell them about Jack being born different. So if you don't know anything about this movie, this movie's about where Jack, Rob Williams, is actually the same age as like a 14 year old, but he looks like he's 30. He was nine months and ready to leave your womb. Nature has given us all an internal clock. It meters out lifespan, controls our growth. Your son's internal clock seems to be ticking faster than usual. So, where were we? Oh my god. Is that the pudding rapist? It is! It's the pudding rapist guy! So Bill Cosby, if you don't know, has been in a bunch of allegations so far that he's raped these women and he's actually found guilty. So, it's actually really weird that he's in this movie, but we'll keep going on. So Bill Cosby in this movie plays Jack's tutor, Robin Williams' tutor, and he tells his parents that he thinks that Jack belongs in public schooling. Of course, his parents don't want that, but then they end up letting Jack go to public schools. So it's Jack's first day of school. You remember your first day of school? I remember. I had like this pouch milk and you like stabbed it. It went all over my face and stuff and everyone laughed and I was the loser that everyone knew. We passed that. So we get to Jack's teacher. Questions? Ms. Marquez, excuse me, but your new student Jack Powell has just arrived. Jack, this is Miss Marquez, your fifth grade teacher. Uh, excuse me? If that's Jennifer Lopez the whole time, I, I can't do this. I'm, I'm older. I'll have a boner. Wait, what? J-Lo's in this movie? I forgot all about this. Hmm. Well, you know what they say about J-Lo? All them single ladies, right? <laughs> I don't know music. Who gives a shit? Let's back to the movie. You okay, Jack? I'm okay. Wait, so you know that this student is bigger and taller than all the other kids, and you give them this, this fucking desk? This, this desk that's the same size? Of course it's gonna break. What the fuck were you thinking? Whatever. Oh, God. So the movie goes on, and Jack actually friends the three guys. There's one guy that's Louie. Uh, the other guy, I, I don't fucking know. He looks like from the Stand By Me cast. Rick Moranis as his younger self. Guys, this is Jack. Oh man, I got a bad hip. Sorry. And of course, you know, if you had a friend that looked like that, what would you do? Of course. I'd make him buy booze, right? That's it. Nope, not booze. <laughs> so, so what they do is they make him buy porno for them, and puts them up in a tree house. And let's just look at this tree house one more time. I don't know about you, but that passes no OSHA or safety laws that I've ever been in or been a part of. It's fucking terrible. All right, it, it can't go wrong, right? Never could go wrong. Let's keep going. <laughs> I want to hear a manly rip. 
show us what you're made of. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, just, just warming up. Just clearing my throat. I feel it down below. <laughs> I almost blew a seam on my pants. Oh, here comes another one. Real rectal rockets. Oh, yes. Out, demon spirit. Whoa, so. Wait, wait, what? 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 Who did? Oh my gosh. Who thought this was a good idea? Like, fart in a can? Like, oh my gosh. We can hear now. It just won't stop. It won't stop farting. <laughs> I'll never look at coffee the same way again. Thank you, Jack. Jack, you better eat this. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Mix it up. I what are you doing? Sardine. Yeah. Oh, no, you. Oh, oh, I know no, I can't do it. Oh, no, no, don't put that in. Don't put that in. Go, 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 Okay, spaghetti, okay, we're making spaghetti here. Okay, a little bit of ancho. What, what, hey, oh, whoa, wow, toothpaste. What the? Oh, oh. You know what this is? I've seen this multiple times. It's a cult. Stay away from those kids. Cults are bad and they'll feed you spaghetti full of anchovies and toothpaste. So after a while, they become really best friends, and Louis actually asks Jack to do something for him, and that is to lie and say he's the principal so that Louis's mom will be like, hey, you know, it's okay. Uh, but it doesn't go the way that Jack wants him to do it. <laughs> <laughs>